What's up everybody? Jimmy Funko is back with another video. I saw on Sean Ryan's whatnot page that he had this bad boy for sale, so I had to buy it to go along with the 10 inch run I bought from Sean a few weeks ago. The extra large Shenron. This guy is so freaking amazing. I know there is two other versions of this guy. There is a glittered version. It looks exactly the same, but it's glittered. And there is an all white version that actually comes from Funimation that I kind of got just um, got in one of their mystery boxes in their last video. So yeah, I was the 51st to unlock this and he is number 969 of 2016. And his power is 2310. And about the powers, <clears throat> I'll read you what Figpen says about the powers. It says, Every Figpen ever made comes with a factory score. This score is determined by the three manufacturing facets of that Figpen, addition, volume, and sequence. A Figpen story score tells the history of that Figpen after it has been adopted by the collector. Adapter score is the first story score facet of every single fig pen. Additional story score facets are coming soon. It says if you multiply a fig pen factory score with its story score, you will get its fig pen power. So if you have a 50 and a 100, it's it's a, equals to 5,000. And it says a fig pen's power will remain with that fig pen forever, regardless if it is sold or traded or added into another collection. So, that is the fig pen power. So I have been getting a lot of good ones lately, so. So yeah. <clears throat> it is really awesome. Um, fig pens are just super awesome. The details and just the way that they're made. Because it's a big piece of metal that somehow they, they engrave all of this awesome stuff in and they paint somehow. I wonder if there's a video showing how they actually make these because I would love to uh, find that out. And they come with these, if you take them out of the box, which actually I could, I don't know why I don't, but when you take them out of the box, there is, if you want to stand them up, they, they, come, with these, they come with these rubber stands so you can stand them up like this on your shelf which is pretty cool. And for those that haven't seen the, the numbers on the back that you type in, there is a little, there is teeny tiny numbers down here that you type into your, your app and then it pops up and tells you what your scores are and what your power is. And I think my highest power is over 8,000 I think. My Stranger Things fig pens that I actually showed off in one of my latest videos, they just, uh, they are all 30% unlocked now. And when they, when they are 10% unlocked, 20% unlocked, and 30% unlocked, they add 10 or more fig pen powers to your scores. So that is pretty cool. So now all of those are over 5,600 um, fig pen powers, I think. And I know there's ways that you can help your friends get more power to their um, fig pens by um, by pressing a button or something, or boosting. It's called boost, I think. So if you go to your friends, um, I think mine's James, I forgot what it's called. Let me get back on my fig pen. I think it's my name, I think. Then you can find every fig pen. I think you have five um, boosts that you can use a day to help your friends' fig pens get more power, I think. Well, mine's just James Dieter, one word. So if you go to my, if you go to James Dieter, I think you can see every single fig pen that I have, and you can uh, boost them up, which I don't really care about that, but, but yeah, I'm just uh, happy that I found these fig pens because there are still tons of fig pens at my Target that people, usually people don't even buy them because I still have a couple of those Ivors that are um, Target exclusives. I think I might have a Sonic. I know there's a SpongeBob and Patrick I'd like to get. There's a Wally from the Wally movie. 
There's a bunch of Disney ones. The Star Wars ones are coming out from the um, animated show on um, Cartoon Network. Oh, Rebels, I think it's called. There's a couple of those fig pens that look pretty cool. Which, maybe I'll get one today since I'm going to the bank. But I don't want to spend all the money that I take out of the bank in one day. Like I do when I usually take money out. So, but I'm definitely buying a frame for my autograph bleach picture from Hapalucha. I'm definitely doing that today, and I'm going to put it above my uh, t where my TV is. And maybe I'll show a little video of my my two bleach. I have two bleach pictures over here. I don't think I ever showed, or maybe I did in my my room tour. I think I showed them all. But yeah. <coughs> This is my fig pen video, and it might be the last video I have for a while, unless I come up with something else to talk about. So, yeah, until next time, or until I post another video, this is Jimmy Funko telling everyone out there to please remember to be kind to one another, and have a nice day.